Hello guys, this is on the op server. Right in the description. Uh, this is a drop party, so yeah, enjoy. Alright guys, that I think looks like the about end of the drop party. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was about to say these drop parties last a while. 
Um, trying to see if I could get some more god apples. I don't believe it or not, I don't have that many on the server. Um, hmm. Holy crap. Yeah, but I'm gonna make a PvP series out of this. Like, just a huge series. Doesn't matter. Raiding, PvP, building houses, just whatever. And, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. For background noises. Uh, I guess that's it. I mean, I have <laughs> a lot of stuff. So, we should be good for this whole entire series. Oh, that's my, that's my bird talking. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna build a huge unraidable, well, hopefully unraidable base in this series. I know pretty much all bases can be raided, vanilla, like with enderpearl glitches, boat glitches, just anything like that. And this base has actually been raided before. It's just in mine and Noah's, well, uh, Kizanakin's base. Uh, it's pretty much like it got raided, or it's not raided, it's just completely full. And we can't put any more stuff in to the base, so. And why did I not claim this? I had my friend David, Scooby, right there. I have, I had him and his sister Casamina build this base. And I guess they forgot to claim it, or I forgot to claim it, so. That kind of sucks, but. There's drop parties every day. It's a really good server. I love it. Highly recommend it. Just come join. It's, it's a really fun server. So, yeah. Gonna, don't know what I want to do this episode. I might PvP. But you, the last video that I uploaded was on this server, and I was PvPing, so I might not. Um, I think I have some bed. Okay, yeah, I have a lot of bedrock in there. The potato, and you guys might be wondering why I was throwing out so much good loot, and that's because the potato stuff, like the potato sword and armor and stuff, that's way better than this drop party stuff. So. But it doesn't have unbreaking, which kind of sucks, but it's still a lot better to PvP with. And yeah, uh, didn't get any god apples. I usually bring just one, so when I, like, when the, they come down, I pick, like, a stack up, but I forgot to do that. Because I kind of logged on and it was, like, drop party at spawn, or at warp drop party, or DP. So, I didn't really have much time to do anything, really. I usually prepare... Oh, okay, no, I don't want that. Um, but the drop parties are every day. The server, I like it because it is extremely overpowered. But yet, at the same time, it has its limits. Like, they don't give you protection, like, 50. But if you guys are... If you guys do like the like protection 20, 50, stuff like that, there's another op server that will be in the description too. So if you want to go check those servers out, you can. And yeah, there's probably going to be a lot of background noises, but I really don't care. Can't help that. Um, I will probably be donating for the server soon. Oh, and I got these special Simon apples. <laughs> I think I was like one of the person people that got that and here they never give God stuff out because this is a donation rank but yesterday they gave out a full only a full set of God stuff so I think I was the only one to get that God sword which is awesome and I got special Simon apples so yeah I think I will go try to build a base but on this server it's pretty hard too because a lot of people follow you when you jump out of spawn and yeah I think I don't know I'll probably cut this to where I ran probably a couple thousand to three thousand blocks away from spawn and I'll see you guys when I could well when I have a good place to build 
I'm swimming on this infinite pool of water. So let's hope that it ends soon. Or I may just build my base somewhere over here in the water. But I don't know. I'm not going to make you guys sit through that. I cannot wait till 1.7 comes out. <laughs> Where these stupid infinite waters just stop. This is so annoying. I've been swimming here for probably around <laughs> 30 minutes. And I know I could probably build here and never be found. But I don't think I want my base to be in the water. Oh, there's people building here. That's great to know. So where I'm probably going to build my base is people have already been here. That's awesome to know. Alright guys, I think I found the place where I want to build my base. So yeah, I'm going to start building it. And I th if I'm pretty sure I have a pickaxe in here. Are, are you serious? Slash set um, vault. Oh, I can't set any more homes. Um, not sure what I'm going to do about that. Uh Gosh, I hate this. Um, actually, I think David has his home set at that vault, so shouldn't be too worried. Slash set. Well, yeah, I ran all the way out here. I'm not about to freaking go back and then have to run back out again. And I ran into quite a few of people. They were chasing me. A lot of people. But they kind of quit after I swam for like three to four thousand blocks. <laughs> I'm pretty far out. I don't. I hope I won't get raided because I'm pretty far out. I don't think anyone would try to raid someone going that far out. But then again, wow, kids must have gotten a lot of god apples because I remember there just being a few in here. What am I doing? Okay, there we go. Um, yeah. Wow, that's a lot of god apples. I'll take some bedrock with me, too, so I don't have to waste mine out of my ender chest. Take that. I'll take some ender pearls. And I could decorate my base with some blocks, like of ores. Um, I don't know. I think I might do that later on. Okay, so let's do that. Slash home. Get some bedrock. Should. Oh, wow. I have a stack of god apples on me. I didn't know that. Um. I think that'll be it. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. I will. By the next episode, I'll have my whole entire base ready and done. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. And bye.